All right, YouTube, how you doing? This is Mike. This is Jenny. Grace. Andrew. Grace. Peter. With the Pratt Family Homestead, we've been uh, asked to do a meal. What's this called, babe? Frugal Family Food. Whoo, I'm glad she's here to speak for me more. <laughs> uh, so mostly Jenny and the kids have put together a fantastic dinner here. And, uh, the term frugal for us might be different than other people, um, or it may be the same. Uh, Jenny does look for deals while she's shopping and stuff, but uh, for us it really started a year and a half ago when we moved out here, and we started growing and raising all of our own food. Um, our whole meal tonight is not everything that we've grown, uh, but we have we did last year, just ran out, uh, and we're going to this year as well. So this meal, especially in another month or two, this meal will cost us nothing right. in another, uh, except for raising the chicken. So, do you want to give a quick rundown uh, of what, what got us here or what, what you've made? Um, we did uh, seasoned chicken in the crock pot, and Grace was my assistant with that one. And Andrew and I did an Amish white bread, and Faith helped. Uh, cut up potatoes. The potatoes and the corn we cooked in the crock pot with the chicken. Um, so that was all done all together. And <clears throat> TJ made salad bowls for everybody. And that's awesome. The kids got involved. They they like getting involved. Um, this was actually a change up. We were originally, Jenny was going to do a oven roasted <clears throat> chicken. But life plans and all that other good stuff. Boom! Crock pot. <laughs> crock pot's the easiest way to go. <laughs> Alright, so... Jenny, Jenny's gonna, Jenny and the kids mostly, I wasn't really involved. Jenny and the kids are gonna take you guys through the meal and um, hope you enjoy. Uh, thanks a lot, let's check it out. So for the chicken, we're going to do one of our roosters that we harvested and helping me with the chicken is Grace. She's gonna help me season the chicken. We're gonna put it in the crock pot. You can do it crock pot or oven roasted, whatever works easiest for you and throw on some seasonings. I'll tell you what we do, but really, I mean, with chicken, you can do whatever you want. And we're also gonna add a can of our corn. And the reason I'm adding this now is because we didn't harvest our corn in time, and so it became chewy. So adding it in and letting it cook all day helps get rid of that chewiness. We chewy. thought maybe we would, <laughs> we thought we would kinda not chewy. eat it and have to waste it, but once I found out that soaking it helps to get rid of it, um, we are actually able to use it. Which... Okay, so in the crock pot, I already have homemade chicken stock that I made from one of the other roosters that we had eaten. So I'm going to take him and put him, for now I'm going to put him leg side down so we can season the top of him. I will end up flipping him over later. So what do you have there? This is oregano. Pick your next one. Some pepper. Um, pepper. Cumin. Some real salt, paprika, some garlic powder, and some onion powder. Whoa! I hold this. You can hold that. Mommy, all toy. This is our corn. All. All of it? Yeah. Add it all in there. And now we're just going to fill it up a little bit more with some water. And in a little while, in a few hours, I'll go ahead and I'll flip the chicken, add a little seasoning on the other side, and um, throw the potatoes in. Okay, to go along with our dinner, and just to have on hand, we're going to make homemade bread. We do just a basic Amish white bread. It's easy, it's fast and the kids love to help. So helping me with the bread is, tell me your name? Andrew. Andrew, yes, he is going to help get his hands dirty. So mm -hmm. first, we'll do the yeast. Dump that in, please. Get mm -hmm. the sugar. Mm -hmm. And here is our water, uh -huh. very slowly. Go ahead and give it a little mix. Am I doing a good job? You are. Alright, and we're going to let this go ahead and proof. We put it in the sink with, filled with uh, some warm water. 
It helps proof it better. And then when we do the rise, we also uh, preheat our oven. Okay, so our yeast has proofed. So now we're going to add in our oil and our flour. Okay, so you keep mixing. Crazy. What are you guys making? Bread. You're making bread, bud? Okay, so what we need next is the potatoes. So, our helper for the potatoes is Faith. Faith. Okay. Fingertips. Thank you. push on top if you need to. Perfect. Carefully push the potatoes into the liquid. Doesn't look like we're really going to need to add any more water. Maybe we will. Maybe we will. Push. Give it a good push. Straight down. Squish all the air out of it. See these air bubbles? We want them out of our bread. TJ is going to make salad bowls since they're isn't anything else to cook and we just pick him up so his contribution for tonight is making salad bowls for everybody this currently right now is store-bought but we're hoping to grow a lot of greens and things like radishes and carrots and stuff like that in our garden this year so it'll be just going out and picking fresh stuff cutting up some mushrooms right now got tomatoes and cheese Pull the chicken out. Let's see how this goes. Oh, buddy. We got chicken falling apart. Woo! Really falling apart. That's a good sign. Potatoes and corn are still in there. We'll fish those out too. All right. How's the food, everybody? Man, baby, this is good. How's it going? Yeah. Mmm. Must be good. Kids with mouths full of food. Nobody's talking. <laughs> All right. Everybody enjoy. All right. Wow. That was a good meal. Jenny and the kids did fantastic. Um, and while, while we're trying to be more self-sustaining, um, we have a very long ways to go. So, um... Any of these meals that we have that can mostly be uh, meals that we've grown or raised ourselves are really cool and we're getting more and more of those meals. Right. More and more our plates are everything from our little uh, uh, homestead here. So uh, yeah, we want to just say thanks. Yep. Uh, Tangi, the caver's wife, and Amanda at the Fundamental Home started the the Frugal Family Food Collaborations, and so we want to thank them for reaching out to us and asking us to do this. It was fun and uh, nice to be a part of that group. There's going to be a link in the description box of the playlist of all the previous Frugal Family Food Collaboration videos, so be sure to go and check out everybody's <laughs> stuff. Go check out everybody's videos. And uh, definitely stay tuned for more because I know there's going to be more as well. And those are some good videos. So go check out that playlist. There's a lot of good ideas out there yes. that people are putting out. Um, let's recap this real quick. This was our own chicken. Our rooster, yes. Oh, we raised it out of the incubator. Um, uh, the corn was ours. The potatoes, our potatoes kind of just went bad. So Jenny had to go buy potatoes. Yes. And did you tell me that... You estimated we used about one dollars worth of potatoes. Maybe, yep, maybe about a dollar's worth of potatoes tonight. And then uh, the stuff used to make the two loaves of bread was, you know, everybody knows Seven. how that is. That's pennies or you know yeah. whatever. And then the salad, you know, uh, a buck or two into the salad. Yeah. Um, it's not prepackaged. I mean, we buy it and we cut it up and all that stuff. So uh, we're looking at definitely under five bucks. Definitely under definitely. five dollars. Feed a family of six. 
and everybody was full. Everybody is full. There's even a little bit, I think, of the potatoes left. So, Jenny and the kids did great. Thanks, babe. You're welcome. So, I hope somebody else does this and enjoys it, and uh, definitely go check out all the other videos. All right, cool. Uh, if you like what you see, definitely check out the whole, what's it called? He'll get it eventually. Family Frugal Food Collaboration. The playlist. It's down here in the description. Check it out. Uh, and uh, if you like what you see here, like, share, subscribe. Facebook, Instagram. Oh, all right. We're doing good. All right. Thanks, YouTube. You guys have a good day. Bye.